I returned to the current site of the Centralia Mine Fire in Pennsylvania on the 24th of May, 2023. The fire is pretty much extinguished under the town of Centralia itself. The underground fire is confined to this 250 feet or 75 meter long area along the cliff just off of Big Mine Run Road. As of this writing, this is the only steaming area near Centralia. However, another fire burns about two miles or three kilometers east of here known as the Girardville Fire, and that is for another day. In addition to taking temperature and thermal imaging readings, I also decided to take some carbon monoxide readings as well. Okay, we're back at Centralia. Today is the 24th of May, 2023. What we're gonna be doing today is carbon monoxide readings, temperature readings, and also thermal imaging. You can see there's a little bit of steam coming out of this vent right here. Okay, so right up next to this vent right here. Let's see how hot it is down there. That's about the same I've been getting from last year. I remember about two years ago, it was up to 145. Let's see if we get back there, 127. Ooh. Let's just check for carbon monoxide, see if there's any. Nope. Be careful going down here. 118. Hundred and twenty one, whoa. Let's see if we can get some carbon monoxide coming up. Uh uh, none. Okay, we just came from that vent. Now we're gonna go up there. Okay, you can see some uh, minerals, mineral deposits by, by the fire right there. And it's kind of warm inside here too. That's where we just came up from. But I'm getting readings in here. 104, 116. Nine. Okay. Wow. The hot spots there. Up, up there. It's warm ground. And it's definitely here. Pretty hot. Made it to the top. There's a giant crack. See a hole. It goes way down in there. I can feel the heat coming out from that. This little fissure. 119. Hundred and twenty-six. Here's the thermal imager of the fissure. Yeah, you can see the hot spots down there. Uh, there we go. Gotta tilt it a little bit so y'all can see it. There you go. Wow, that one's glowing. Okay, now let's go check out this pipe over here. This is one of the pipes that were used to vent the heat and the gases back in the 80s. Cool. Look at that, ants. Yep, no heat coming from it whatsoever. Okay, let's see. Okay, we, we just came from over there where the fissure was at. As you can see, there's no... I don't see any activity up here on the hillside. Nothing. That's, yeah. It's not even warm. It's probably the heat from the sun. Yeah, but right now it feels cool. Just came down from up there. 
slipped once though. Now we're gonna head over here. Okay. There's a path over there. I don't recognize that from last year. I wonder where that goes. We're gonna find out. Let's go check it out. Right. There's a hot spot right there. Let's get a little closer. Yeah. yeah it's pretty warm down there. Got some warm spots. We're gonna go right over there and see if there's any hot spots. What we got over here. Okay. So we got anything down there. Got a couple of warm areas there. Yep, those are the hot spots from from before. Alright. A couple over here, not much. So let's move on a little farther. Okay, now, let's see what we got here. Oh, I know it's not spreading south, so I don't see anything. Nothing. Okay, just came from over there. Okay, that's the southern terminus. And obviously there's not much going on just beyond that. The activity practically ends right here. There's a few hot spots and that's it. So we're gonna go up this trail, see where it goes. It's a little steep. A little slippery, yeah. Oh God, oh yeah. Okay, grab one of this. Okay, I just came up from this, this side, which is just south of the area I was at before on top. The other area was just right over there. So, there's a crack, not too deep, about six inches. Came across this pipe. And, and you can see, it's hot. There's steam coming out of there. See if there's anything on the side. I don't see much. Looks like all the activity is concentrated right below here and down in that area. Alright, we're back near the first fence. So what we're going to do is go a little bit farther north and see if there's any uh, heat signatures there. Other than that, it appears that the activity is mainly confined to there, to about here, to a lesser extent, just right over there, just to the south. And you can see the steam, this is the most active one. So we're going to head over here. Signature right there, right there in the middle. Okay, let's see if there's anything down here. Not much. Oh, that's the same one. Let's see if we got anything over here. 